How can I get maximum dollars for my home when it comes time for me to sell? Hi, this is Arlene Lafferty of Remax Execs, your real estate mom, discussing today, how can I get maximum dollars for my home when it comes time for me to sell? There are two areas that may need your attention. First, the outside for curb appeal. Second, the inside that we want to make so attractive that people want to stay there forever. First, the outside. Mow it and plant it. Create great curb appeal. Most home buyers will spend about 10 seconds looking at a digital photo of your home on the internet. If they like what they see, they'll do a drive-by showing. You have approximately six seconds to impress them. Make the most of what you have by giving your landscape a power lift. Trim hedges and trees, plant colorful flowers, mow the grass and edge your beds. New grass in the front can make an old yard look brand new. Add new house numbers, a nice doorbell or knocker, and a plush new entry mat. Make sure the front door looks great and functions perfectly. Then power wash, touch up, or repair the exterior of your home for an irresistible package. Now for the inside. Clean it. Give your home a thorough cleaning from top to bottom. This includes the walls, floors, and windows. Window treatments, carpets, faucets, and fixtures. Dust, scrub, and polish till everything sparkles and smells clean. Organize it. Take everything off your kitchen and bathroom countertops. Half the books off your bookshelves and start packing the clothes out of the closet that are not needed for this season. Declutter and pare down. Potential buyers want to see your home, not your possessions. A sparse interior containing just enough furniture to suggest each room's purpose and to provide a sense of scale is ideal. Clean out drawers. Empty closets and attics. Vacate the basement and tidy the garage. Consider renting an inexpensive self-storage unit for items you don't want in the home during a showing. And most importantly, remove the family photos. You want the visitor to think of the home as theirs, not yours. Fix it. Fix the cracked window panes. Fix the sticking doors, dripping faucets, running toilets. Caulk your bathtubs and showers. Screw in the knobs. Replace the rotting wood mantles and repair the holes in the porch screen door. The better shape your home is in, the more a home buyer will pay for it. Finally, let the sun shine in. Open draperies and curtains. Illumination is important. Use bright light bulbs. Let prospective buyers see how cheerful your home can be. If you have pets, keep them out of the way and preferably out of the home. This is Arlene Lafferty saying goodbye for now. Until we meet again to discuss another important real estate question.